Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today's video I have a Sheen haul. This is the first haul that I've done from Sheen for uh, craft supplies and I love everything that I've got so I just thought I'd do a little share of what I've got and I'll put the links to everything in the description box if they're still available. And um, this is like two orders that I've done um, and I have already placed another order as well because I'm just loving everything. And so I'm just going to jump straight into it and show you what I've got. So I'm going to start off with these clear sequin pieces that I've got. So I've got these little lemon ones. I love these. I love the detail on them. I think they're so cute. And then I've got these flower ones as well. It didn't say like the amount that I was going to get. Um, and these are both the same price and I just found the size, the packet size quite funny of the difference. Um, and you get so many of these ones. I think that these will work nice for like Maggie Holmes garden party colours. So I'm looking forward to making a sequin mix with those. And then next I'm going to show you the packaging that I've got. So I've got these... Um, seen these on Cheryl's Sheen haul and I just have been looking for something just like this so I was really happy to see these. I think that they're going to be perfect for sending charms in and I do have a, a charm swap coming up so I think these are going to be perfect. So I got them in this size and then I got them in a slightly bigger size as well. I'll try and show you the size difference, although they're quite hard to see since they're clear. Um, so that's the size difference, not a huge difference in them. Um, I feel like these ones might be good for like a sequel mix, being a bit bigger. So I'm excited to use those. And then also for packaging, I got these, um, they're like a handbag, gift bag, which I absolutely love. And it's like a frosted clear. Um, I think they're really nice. Send some happy mail in. And I also got this one as well. Um, which again is like a handbag style. Um, this one when it came it was a bit crumpled up. So I'm not sure I'd order another one to be honest. But I, I've been putting stuff in it to try and like, fill it out so it gets its shape. And I think when you put all your things in of course it will keep its shape then. Um, next I'm going to go on to these bead caps which I got. These were a really reasonable price um, and I got them in gold and you get what I really like about it is that you get so many different sizes because so normally when I buy them I just buy like a pack of all the same size but obviously now in this box you get a whole range of different ones which just fits whichever type of bead you're using. Something for everything in there. Excuse me if my voice sounds a bit croaky, I have cold at the moment. So I'm really loving those. They're a nice shade of gold as well. I think that they're really handy in this box as well. And then this next one is just again the same thing but different designs. This one's massive, look at this one. These would look, work really big and um, good for like the big bubble gum type beads. This box is a bit harder to open. Try opening them without launching them everywhere. And um, so these are the different ones. They're quite similar to the other ones. And then like on this side here, you're getting some like really tiny ones. I like the size comparison on them is really good. And then next, I think I might go with beads. So I got these. I think I've seen these on Cheryl's video as well. Um, and they're like little clay. I don't even know what you call them. Like little clay peppermint beads. And I just thought they were really fun. I don't have anything like that. 
I think they'll be really nice to like layer up with like one of these with a bead on as well so it's not like too flat and I love this red one that'll just be so nice for Christmas and then I got these heart beads and I love the colours on them they're really bright and vibrant and you get a really nice range of different colours as well I think the pink ones are all really really nice for Valentine's Day I'm excited to use those I got this huge bag of these frosted pastel beads and I love the colours on these. I've had some before and I think I've just I used them all. So I'm so happy to see that these came in such a big bag. Because literally such a good value for the price as well. So I'll definitely be using up those pretty quick. One of my favourites. And then I got this huge tub of star beads. So I nearly spilt them everywhere. Um, and you get absolutely loads of these. You get them in pink, blue and purple. And it's like a bead within a bead. It's like you get your clear and then the star bit is in the colour. I like those. And you get them in this tub as well, which is really handy. Next, I've got these beads. And they're like the berry beads. And then they've got like a sequin on top. I've never seen before and they come with like the little loops on already so they're like already wire wrapped I love that I think it looks really nice I think you could definitely make your own as well with different colour sequins on I like these ones because they look like little strawberries <laughs> cute next I've got these crackle heart beads I haven't got anything like this already. And I think that these look really pretty. And the hole is in the middle and it's not too big. So it's going to be perfect for wire wrapping. And again, these pink ones are going to be really perfect for Valentine's crafting. <clears throat> Next, I've got these letter beads. And I just thought these colours were just something a bit different. They're like more muted tones rather than bright colours. Um, and I like that you get ones with just like stars, hearts and flowers on as well. So I'm excited to use some of them. I've got these little like pearl beads and they've got like a bit of gold leaf on. And I already have the little loop on them so you don't have to wire up them. Which is very very handy. And you get them in like pastel colours, nice range of colours too. Love those. And next I got these flower beads, they're like um like plastic or acrylic. And I just think that they're quite cute. And then sticking with the flower theme, I also got these ones. Which I really like. I like how chunky they are. It's like clear beads and then they've just got this circle centre is the colour. All different pastel ones and again the hole's a good size for wire wrapping. I'm excited to use them and put some on dangle charms. And then for the other beads I've got, I've got these two strands of blue beads. I just thought the colours were really standing out to me. So I've got these ones. I think they are super pretty. You get a range of different colours on the strand. And they're quite a nice size, nice and shiny as well. Love them. And then I just got these ones, which are like a pale blue. Um, and the ones are a bit bigger. And again, they're like really shiny. I really like them. Um, and then next, I might go on to the seasonal things I got because I picked up a few seasonal things. So I got some Halloween charms. 
I finished Halloween crafting for this year, but I'm just going to put these away for next year because I didn't really have any charms, so I thought I'll just get some while I've seen them available. So you get like a pumpkin, pumpkin with a hat, a little cat, ghost, and then you get like repeats of them all as well. Oh, they were cute. And then that was all I got for Halloween, but then I got a few Christmas things. So I got these clay beads. I love the little pink snowman ones. That's definitely my favourite. And then I also got these snowman ones, which are just a snowman by themselves, which I think are so cute. I love them. And then I got this pack of bowls, and I didn't expect that I would get so many. It's a really big pack. I think it might be like 50 in the pack. Um, so you got like this green one with like the snowflake and the bauble and then you also get it with the same polka dot and then the same in red polka dot and then you get one with like a pattern on. Quite a nice size as well. I'll definitely look forward to using them. And then the last of the Christmas things I got are these charms. So different ones that you get, you get a little stocking, a reindeer, I love that one, that's really cute. And you get a pink snowman, a little Santa, Christmas tree, I love these. This is the first time I'm looking at them, I'm like opening them up and they're really cute. And then I also got a few Valentine's crafting things as well because I just love thinking ahead and planning getting everything in advance and then when you're ready to craft for that season you've got it straight away so i got actually this all comes as a pack so you got this tray of beads and then these two pack of beads with them as well so i got these two so you get one it's like a light pink and it's like pearl iridescent and then these ones are like a matte pink and that. I think they're slightly different sizes as well. And then I got this tray. And it has all different types of pink beads. So you get these huge hot ones. And then you get some little pink. Oh, I thought they were sweets, but they look like um, bunny ears maybe. Um, then you get some like stars. Also get these stars. And these ones are like little teddy bears. Quite cute. Little gummy bears. Um, and then you also get a butterfly design. And these big bowls. I really like these. Um, and then these are the pink flowers in the from the flower pack beads that I got as well. And some more stars, some clear hearts and some of them matte beads. So I think that's a really nice set actually. I'm very happy with that. And again I love that it comes all divided up in the box. It's really handy. Um, and then the last thing for Valentine's is I got these clear beads. And they just say like love, and there's like a little envelope, a balloon, love those. And then the last thing is all of the charms that I've got, and there's quite a few. So, oh actually there was these charms which I had in my sort of like Valentine's pile. Um, I thought that they go well, so it's like a gold heart shape with a little pink enamel heart on it. And then... I got these paw print charms. You get them in purple, brown, blue, pink. Um, I think that was all the colours. Thought they were cute. And then I got these butterflies. You get these in like a pale pink, a blue, and a teal. Thought that these would go good with Maggie Holmes because a lot of the collections have butterflies in. And then I got these. Pink, purple, and yellow rainbows. 
because I'm of course there for all of the rainbow things. I thought these were quite cute rather than like the something a bit different in the traditional type. Next I got these rolls charms and they're quite a big size. I've seen people using these before when they've sent me craft things and I'm like loving them so I was really happy when I seen these available. <laughs> quite nice, very simplistic but pretty. And then I got some different bear charms, so I got these brown ones. Like your traditional teddy bear. They were cute. I thought that these would be really nice for like baby projects or to go with like um the collection by Simple Stories Boho Baby. I often use that um to make like non baby items just because I like the animals and the rainbows in it. I thought that they would go really nice with that collection. And then I got these colourful bears as well. So you get them in all different colours. You get some yellow as well. I just thought these were quite fun, quite cute. Something a bit different. Oh, you get an orange one as well. And then I got these flower charms. So these look like they come in white blue purple pink and black and they've just got like the gold edge on them i really like them i got these ice cream charms It'd be good for the summer and also these donut charms also be good for summer crafting so i'll probably put them away for next year now i got these Flower charms, I think they're like tulips. They're quite a big size actually, I was expecting them to be a bit smaller, but I do still like them. Very cute. Whoops. And then I have got these ones, which are like some tassels. <coughs> so these ones um, and I thought these would be really cute to add on some embellishments someone recently sent me some some like circle embellishments and then they hung these from the bottom and they looked really cute. And they were really tiny size. Like really tiny. And then underneath, like the suggested from these ones, are these little flower ones. Which I also really like. I love these mint ones and the pink ones. Definitely be ones I use first. And then like some of them are like pattern, they've got like a leopard print, like a zebra print. Which is really cute. And then the last things are these gold charms and these all match together really well they're really pretty so i've got these leaf ones again i think i've seen people using these i think i might have received some in mail and i've loved them and then i've got these teardrop ones And I think these are so pretty, so, so pretty and so elegant looking. How gorgeous are those? And like the bottom detailing is like flowers. If you can see. Like really detailed. And then these ones are also really detailed. 
like little circle charms with flowers on and bees on. Absolutely love those. And I think the three of them will go together like on a charm dangle, like really nice because all matching together. So that's everything that I've got on this sheen haul. And I'm sure that I'll probably be doing another sheen haul in the future. Because like I say, I'm just absolutely loving the product product and they came so quick as well that only took a week to arrive um, and all, all great prices so thanks so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you in the next video bye